right, in this video, what I'd like to do is show you how I heighten highlights uh, uh, with the Sargent brush. What I mean by heightening highlights, it's the lightest area within the highlight. So this is a highlight here, this is a highlight here, this is a highlight here. But we oftentimes get a, a, a lighter light within the highlight, and that is called heightening your highlight. So I like to really do this with the uh, sergeant brush. So we will grab the sergeant brush. Where it's found is it's under the uh, uh, artist medium or uh, the menu here for for uh, medium uh, and then uh, that's where you'll find it. So um, we'll take a little bit uh, where you generally find the the heightened highlights first of all is uh, usually where there's a plane change. So right here in the apex of the nose. So the lights coming a little bit stronger from this side um, so we'll hit the apex of the nose here so I'll choose that color and then considering temperature of light I'm going to move it around to a warmer light uh, and we'll grab a lighter um, tint of that now I like how um, it really kind of acts like um, uh, oil a thick oil if I zoom in or uh, get a little bit larger and you see it gets this real creamy feel uh, to the, uh, the paint. So what I'm applying and uh, what it's grabbing uh, from underneath. So let me go ahead and get rid of that. Um, so all of the areas that I'm going to highlight will um, be right along that same hue and uh, value or tint of that hue. So we'll hit right here on the um, lower lip. We'll get it right here on the philtrum and low on the philtrum. And you can see I like it kind of with a painterly feel. Okay, with a little bit too much there. You just kind of back off and pull some of that value back in or that paint back in um, and correct that. We're going to get one right here on the inner canthus. Uh, we'll get one in here on the eye. And it's generally, again, where there's a strong uh, plane change or um, reflection. So actually, I'm going to go really light with that. Let's zoom in a little bit into that eye, and we'll uh, a little bit lighter. You can see the paint builds up and it pulls from around um, around it. So we want to uh, hit all of these highlights. Get that canvas a little bit stronger. Maybe a little bit on the outer canthus, but not so much. A little bit in here, okay. Uh, we'll probably hit a little bit of a reflection, uh, a little bit too much there. Pull that back. So you can see I'm just kind of bouncing around and finding those points of plane change um, in order to heighten the highlight. We might get a little bit uh, in here. We definitely get some, but not as bright on the... Uh, zygomatic process that would be occurring right in here, but I don't want that highlight to be too strong or it's going to draw too much attention to itself. All right, so you will hit uh, hit some highlights here. So just getting a bit heightened in those lighted areas. All right, and I don't want it consistent all the way through. Maybe throw a couple in here on the chain to give a little bit of visual interest. Um, but I really, really uh, like the uh, Sargent brush a lot because it has that kind of that real creamy, rich feel to it as I'm, you know, pulling the paint around and, and having fun with it. Uh, and this is what, what allows you to keep it with kind of that painterly uh, feel to your work. All right, so heightening your highlights with the Sargent brush. It's a great way to go.